Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with GTA 5. While playing the game or while launching the game, you got a black screen and you are not able to do anything. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, in the basic step, I recommend to play the game using the Steam. If you are playing the game using Rockstar Launcher, ignore it. Launch the Steam, click on the option library, click here add a game and choose the option add a non steam game. Over here scroll down and find Rockstar Launcher and click on the option add selected program. And secondly is right click on start menu, choose the option device manager. From here you need to expand your display adapter. Whichever GPU you have, make sure you update the drivers from the official website. Again, I am telling you to update both the drivers. First one is your integrated GPU and second one is your dedicated GPU. Make sure you update both the GPUs by downloading the drivers from their official website. If you need more help on updating your GPU drivers, go ahead and contact me onto my Discord whose link I'll provide you in the description of this video. After updating the drivers and launching the game using the Steam, we'll fix out the issue of black screen. However, if this failed to work out, in next step, again click on right click on start menu, choose the option device manager. From here, expand display adapter. Now from here, whichever your integrated graphic driver is, suppose first one is my integrated driver. So simply right click and choose the option disable device. Once disabled, launch the game. If game doesn't launch, Again right click and choose the option enable to make this GPU driver enabled into your system. After disabling and then enabling your integrated as well as dedicated GPU, relaunch the game to fix out the black screen issue. If this fails okay, let's proceed to the third step. Right click on your GTA 5 extension and choose the option properties. Click on compatibility tab and from here you need to check mark two options. First one is disable full screen optimization and nextly is click on the option run this program in compatibility mode. From here you need to try two options one by one. First one is windows 8 apply ok and launch the game. If doesn't work choose windows 7 apply ok and launch the game. Hopefully this will resolve the issue for you. Now if this method also failed to work out let's proceed with the third step. Right click on start menu choose the option run. Type here percentage, local app data percentage and then hit the enter key. Press the R key to find Rockstar Games folder. Open it. Open GTA 5 folder and here you will find a file with the name settings.xml. Simply right click on this file and choose the option delete. After deleting this will now go ahead relaunch your game to fix out the issue of GTA 5 black screen issue. If this also fail to work out, in next step click on start menu and type in resource monitor. Open the resource monitor. Now right over here under the processes, all the processes that are running in your system will be shown right over here. What you need to do is to temporarily pause the process of GTA 5 and then resume the process. To do so, select GTA 5, right click and choose the option suspend process. Once you suspend the process, wait for around 20 to 30 seconds. And after waiting for 30 seconds, again right click on GTA 5 and this time choose the option of resume process. This will remove the excessive usage of the CPU and in turn fix out the issue of black screen while playing the GTA 5. Now if all the methods fail to work out, let's proceed with the last step. Head over to settings menu, choose system and click on the option display over here. Scroll down and click on the option advanced display. Now here note down the refresh rate of your system, for example at my end if it is showing 60 hazards, then you need to switch the refresh rate of the game to 60 hazards only. Do not exceed or do not reduce the hazards below 60. Now to change the refresh rate into a GTA 5, launch the game and click on the graphic settings. Right in the graphic settings, you will find the option of refresh rate. Make sure you choose the option as 60 hazards as my system supports only 60 hazards refresh rate. Once it is done, go ahead, restart your PC and this will completely fix out the issue of GTA 5 black screen issue. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button 
and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.